Hey, what's up guys? This is Houston Online. Welcome back to my channel. Today, we're gonna talk cars. And to be exact, we're gonna talk three vehicles that, in my opinion, you should have. And first up, it's the Pegasi Zen Torno. You can buy it for 725,000 GTA dollars. It's classed as a supercar. Now, it's not the best supercar, it's not the fastest, but it has very good acceleration, it's very easy to control, and it's very competitive in races. I'll explain a little bit more. So as you probably know, to unlock modifications for a certain class of vehicles, like supercars, sports cars, sports classics, whatever, you have to win races in that class, but Winning races in the supercar class unlocks modifications for all classes. Now that, combined with the price of this Centorno, makes it a really good buy. You can win races in this. It's not the fastest, but racers are not straights. They got bends and turns, and you need to accelerate quickly to be competitive. And that's exactly what this car will do for you. The Pegasi Centorno. I highly recommend this one to get. Next vehicle is the HVY Insurgents. You need to complete the uh, the U main labs heist to uh, be able to buy this one. It'll cost you six hundred and seventy-five thousand dollars, and it's armored like nothing else. It can take about five explosions, meaning if you throw your sticky bombs out and they're pretty close to your vehicle, you won't blow up. Other than that, it's pretty cheap to repair at the LS Custom Shop, and it will ram other traffic right out of the way, no problem. Only thing is, the, the windows aren't bulletproof, but in general, when you drive this around, you're protected from rockets and whatnot, every type of explosion you can take, and most of the time, you will survive in this vehicle for a long time. Here we are at the absolute number one vehicle you must have. The Armored Karuma. This car is great. Any type of NPC you encounter doing whatever... ...won't be able to shoot you. They just won't. Their bullets won't penetrate this car, the Armored Karuma. You complete the, the Fleesa job heist to unlock this one, and then you can buy it for a little over half a million dollars, I think. And you can use it for any type of mission. Any NPC you encounter won't be able to shoot you. Now, unlike the Insurgents, this armored Karuma will only stop bullets. Meaning, one explosion is enough to blow it up. So it's not really that handy to use in free roam when you're uh, PvPing, fighting other players. But on missions you do, be it sourcing vehicles, picking up crates, police chases, whatever, the NPCs will never shoot through the windows. That comes in handy when you're trying to make money. You've probably seen me driving this in a couple of videos. And now you know why. Now, as a prime example, I'm doing the VIP work hostile takeover here. Look how easy this is. You gotta go into that hangar. One NPC is standing there holding a briefcase being guarded by other NPCs. Look, you ram him right to his death, those bullets they shoot, you'll get hit a couple of times, but I have never experienced a death in this car by an NPC shooting bullets. And as you probably know, NPCs only shoot bullets, they won't try to explode you. So, fighting NPCs, use the Karuma. You don't even have to get out of it which makes it a very good buy, at a relatively cheap price. 
and that's gonna wrap the video up for today guys thank you so much for watching please subscribe to the channel if you want to stay updated for daily GTA online content like this our stuff as well check out my channel you can see what I have to offer you again thank you so much for watching I'll see you guys the next time buy this Karuma it will serve you well